Hey guys, what is up? I hope everyone is had a good night last night. And I get a little brighter. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna just do some quick makeup here. Um, I'm using the the uh, Dr. Brandt um, backlit or back light primer which is a prime blur and glow so and this seems to be very nice I kind of like it so far um it looks really nice with um the pharmacy BB cream so has like a nice, a nice smell to it or scent. It's nothing too overbearing or anything. It's, I don't know. It's really nice. All right. Um, so that's that. I'm going to let that sit in for a few minutes and then I'm going to go in with, uh, some concealer I'm going to use the uh, Tarte Creaseless Concealer um, to start off with the base. I'm a little tired. I'm sorry, you guys. But, um got this a little bit ago. I figured I might as well give it a, or give it try again. It's not a bad product or anything. It just has like kind of a little bit thicker compared to what I'm used to. Alright. And a little goes a long way, it looks like. Alright, so nothing really crazy going on today, but I'm also not really going to do a huge like makeup look or makeup eye makeup look. Um, apparently I cannot talk today. So I'm going to go in with the Vivid palette here and I'm going to kind of use these two shades. And then I'm going to go in with, um, like another eyeshadow palette as well. Alright, so this is good. So I'm using the Vivid palette through Pharmacy that we have available and I'm going to be using um, like these two shades. I'm nothing, nothing too crazy really. I just not really in the mood to do anything too crazy. So I'm going to use a mixture of Harvest and Terra Rose and put that all over the eyelid. Man, I'm like super tired. Has, did anyone like sleep any good last night? Because for some odd reason, I did not sleep well last night. Alright. So I just started taking um, the collagen shot through pharmacy and I don't know if I'm the biggest fan of the taste of it, but I am going to, even though my hair is always up, I am going to like watch out for, like see what results I get. Um, Mainly so that I can, because I have like these little, my little ringlets, 
that are very prominent now. And then um, my little block, bald spot right here in the middle um, has been like looking a little bit better. All right. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to go in with the Glam Up palette as well. And I'm going to use... Um, you know what? I'm gonna go weird. I'm gonna go in with this shade. It's actually in the Wonderless palette through Pharmacy. And I'm gonna use Dazzle. I'm gonna put that all over the lid. I think it would look good with this. You know what would be really cool? If um, Pharmacy did uh, like multi-chromes or dual chrome eyeshadows. Oh my gosh. I like that. Very interesting combo. Very interesting. Alright, cool. So I'm going in with the Limitless Mascara here. This is $22.90 on my website. If anyone is at all interested in getting this, um, my link will be available. My link is available, I think, in my bio. Um, you guys can get out of the live and go there or you can just wait till after I get done totally up to you all and then um but yeah I'm not gonna it's not too crazy I look or anything I actually I like this Okay. All right. I'll do my lower lashes shortly. Um, I'm going back in with the Pharmacy BB Cream. I think the rest of this week I'm just going to show you all the Pharmacy BB Cream. I love this product. Um, I I mean I love all the pro all the face products that we have through Pharmacy, um, but this one I like it as well just because um, it is a beauty balm and literally will um it's like a light to medium coverage so if you guys like full coverage I would not recommend getting this um but you guys can get this and mix it in with all your other foundations um still have like that moisturizer as well it is super nice. I really enjoy it. Sometimes I mix it in with the VFX foundation and um, just so that I can have like moisture in the skin. But um, I haven't done that in a while. But I do like, I'm using shade 03. It is not a full coverage. Um, as you can tell, you can still see my blemishes, but I also don't really want anything like too um, crazy, but it does provide a good amount of coverage on the skin. 
it doesn't take away my, my freckles or anything. You guys can still see that. Might have added a little too much, but it's okay. But yeah, if you guys are interested in checking this out, it is available on like my website. You guys can definitely get it. If you guys need to be, if you need help on color matching, just type color matching and when I get done here, I will um, message you and I'll help you color get color matched. Okay, I think everything that looks good. Okay, cool. And then um, I am going to use the pharmacy concealer. Um, I don't think this is. Oh well. Might have to throw this one out. It's like almost gone. But, uh, yeah, I'm using, like, a lot of my, a lot of the pharmacy products today. And then if you guys are interested in signing up with pharmacy to get like the 50% off discount, you guys can and, and to sign up, it's only like $20 as well. Okay. So I'm first going to use our BB powder and this will help keep my areas that I had concealed, brighter, and hydrated as well, and we'll keep my makeup as well. Okay, and then my next powder will be the um, shade 3 in our press powder, and I will be using this all over the face. And just get that all in there. Um, I'm also using our pharmacy um, brow powder. Um, I use this a lot as you guys can tell. Um, I use it every time I do my makeup unless I lost it and I can't. But I tend to use this quite a lot mainly just because I love the brow powder but they got rid of it because I don't think it was selling. Um, but we do have the brow pencil, brow wax, and the brow mascara. But I don't use that either, mainly because um, the one that I do have, it's more of like a really rustic brown, and I don't, that's not me, that's not my color. So I just, I use Maybelline or the Kosas one. Alright. I'm going to put on some of the lip conditioner that we have. Love this stuff. Okay. Alright, and then I'm going to go in with that brush here that we had and that I had first used. I want to put that underneath the 
eye a little bit. Just lightly put some color underneath. All right, and then um, we have our three, oh, not three in one. This is our Peach Bite palette. Um, I use the bronzer quite a bit. Um, so I'll be using that today. to warm the face back up. My hair's a mess, I'm sorry you guys. All right, so that is the Peach Bite palette and then I am, I think I'm going to go in with the Peach Blossom blush today. Um, I used the Rose Jam and I figured I might as well go in with <clears throat> um, Peach Blossom. Oh my gosh. be so cool if they did like a cream blush. Okay. And then I'm going to go back in with the Peach Bite palette that we have through here and use the highlighter. It's a very nice subtle highlighter. I love it. I'm going to use the VFX Elite Liquid Matte Lipstick here in 09. It does not. Mm. Every time. The lipsticks do not taste good. to do a lip exfoliating tonight or something. I'm pretty crusty. All right, and then my last thing I'm going to go in back in with the lower lashes because I almost forgot for one and for two, I need to do my lower lashes. Okay, cool. And I think that is it, you guys. Oops. I think that's it, you guys. I hope you all have a good day. Um, my setting spray is like down below me, so I'm just going to set after I get done with this live. Um, I hope you all have a good day, and I'll see you all soon. Bye, guys.